Well, happening today, the Department of Human Services, along with other organizations, are taking part in Purple Ribbon Month in memory of Caitlin Marie Russell. 23 ABC's James Johnson explains what the event is all about and how you can take part. Good morning, James. Yeah, that's right, Mike and Alex. It's all about keeping kids safe in and around hot cars, especially during uh, these summer months. And like you said, the Department of Human Services, along with other organizations, are going to be hosting this event today. And I'm actually here with Officer Robert Rodriguez with CHP to kind of talk to us about this event and just kind of what it's all about. Um, you know, we're actually partnered up uh, with the Department of Human Services, and and uh, this is a very important uh, issue uh, because we're in the summertime and we're day what day 12 of our of our heat wave, and so it's just imperative that parents uh, are made aware. Not not to leave their children unattended in vehicles. Not only is it dangerous, but it is against the law. If, if you leave a child uh, that's uh, under six years old unattended in a vehicle without a supervision of someone who's at least 12 years old or older, then it is against the law. But again, not only is it against the law, but again, imperatively very, very dangerous. Yeah, now, Officer Rodriguez, again, talk to us about, um, you know, obviously you're out there, um, you receive these calls. What, what advice do you have for people who see a child that is left in a car that may be in distress? You know, if you, if you, if you happen to be walking uh, in a parking lot, uh, you know, whatever department story it is, and you see a child that's uh, left unattended in a vehicle, do something. You know, don't just stand there and, and hope that someone is going to come out and, and retrieve their child. We want you to act. Um, don't be afraid of getting into somebody's business because protecting our children is everyone's business. And so uh, react, call 911, and uh, get the child out of the vehicle as soon as possible. Yeah, now, how quickly can it get? Like, I, I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it's going to be close to 100, if not 100 today. How quickly can it get, um, you know, dangerous for a child in a car? Oh, very quickly, especially, you know, when it's 3 o'clock in the afternoon, you know, it's, it's the major heat time, um, you know, temperatures can rise very rapidly. As soon as that air conditioning in that vehicle turns off, mom leaves and leaves the child. And it could be by mistake that she leaves them in the vehicle and walks away. Uh, they could climb very quickly. So again, it's, it's, very, it's, it's imperative that people realize that. And if you do see a child that's uh, maybe unconscious in a vehicle and that child may be sleeping, but still, we need to get that child out of that car. Yeah. Thank you so much, Officer Rodriguez. Again, now this event is going to be happening today here at the St. John's uh, Children's Center here on Buena Vista. That's happening at 11 o'clock. And of course, we're going to have that on our website and on our Facebook page. Uh, streaming it for you. So again, you want to uh, check that out later on today. Reporting live, James Johnson, 23 ABC.